Hello and welcome to a new video about my ball balancer. Last time we learned that with our ultrasonic measurement device we cannot really distinguish the distance to a ball. Uh, so I found uh, this device here. Uh, this device, this is a laser measurement device. Okay, it's a bus interface as you can see and first i had to find out what is where is the front and where is the back where is the back actually it turns out this here is the front okay so there where it is labeled this is the front and uh, so now i'm going to solder in here those parts that i can connect it yeah to te test it because i actually i don't have an idea how to use it if you see how it is working, of course, this is working not with sound, this is working with laser yeah, and measuring the time which it takes for the light to reflect. Incredible, huh? Let's take a <laughs> sip. This is water. Okay, that's it. That's the sensor. And now to the cabling. Plus and minus is clear. Clean ground. Plus and minus. V in is 5 volt. Ground is ground, and then we have SCL and SCD. SCL and SCD. S data. SCL is S serial clock, serial data. All right. Hmm. It should be the hardware setup. Let's see if we can program this. Okay, so we need to add a library, we need to install a library uh, and this library is apparently called uh, Adafruit Library Manager search for uh, V15 V15 What is labeled here? V VL53 oh, VL of course, VL. Okay, VL53 per other fruit. I think this is the correct one. Yes. Install this. Now we add the library. Okay, it's a little bit too much. Book. This should be sufficient. This should be sufficient. Good. And then we have to define here. Uh, uh, how is this done here? Uh, the distance measurement. I call it laser. Laser. Okay. In setup. These two are no longer need. In setup, I will write and this should in it. These are no longer need. Okay, let's upload this. By the way, I found out why why 
the serial the serial plotter did not work because there was no there were there was no distance between centimeter and the who done done all right so it seems like this is working okay here i need the data for the measurement and this is uh, ranging measurement data type this is this yeah measure i call it again distance okay call it dm distance measurement this is good uh, and now laser dot ranging test the address and debug is false yeah. if dm dot what is this status range range status no target so if we have uh, reached the target yeah we say uh, we we print this out dm dot range millimeter multiplied by 10 what is this for a type This should be okay, and then centimeters again. Ah, V15. Ooh, this was here. This is what I wanted to explain first. This is working. This is not working. This is working. This is not working. Okay, so if you're using serial plotter, please take care about the distance between the value and the unit. Uh, because then it can be distinguished otherwise it is not it's just one block okay this is the okay. that's it this should work Okay. You seem surprised. Libraries are good. Okay. I only see one. No echo because it's too far away. Let's see. Well, if this is one centimeter, I'm not sure. It's working better. Does it see the ball? Yes, it sees the ball. Yes, it sees the ball. All right. All right. Hmm. Sadly, we don't see a point. Okay, the only problem, okay, this is a bus, bus device now, all right, so we have a bus device, uh, let's see, uh, there should be, I do the scanner here, let's upload this. Because actually, actually, this should have an address, yeah? I squared C address, huh? this thing. And I don't know the address of the thing. It's written in the description. 
it should be 29. Twenty-nine. Yes. I want later on. I want to have a display. I think this is thirty. But what if we have two different laser distance measurements? One on the left side, one on the right side. You know. Uh, then we should be able to change the address. There was also written something that is that we are able to change the address. I have to look into this. I have to look into this, I have to redesign. I have to redesign the end yeah, so that we can put in because actually it is looking pretty good. Uh, so of course there's another wrong <laughs> the wrong program on. Let's upload this once again and I want to check here if this is working. Therefore, I'm going to grab this. Red is V in, blue as the clock is green and the data is yellow. The clock is green and the data is yellow. Alright, now I want to check. Okay. Okay, here we see the distances and if I put it here, can we see the distance to the other side? Yes. Okay, this is good already. Let's place the ball there. Okay, and now let's have a look at this on the serial plotter, because right now it should work. Hopefully, yes. Now this looks like a measurement. I'm just holding it by hand, so it should work. Okay. Laser distance measurement, much better than sound distance measurement. Well, I have to redesign these end caps here and then probably it's working. Also good, right? Also good to us. For this time, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.